Hey everybody, Jim here, bringing you round four of the January New Year's Retribution Malifaux Vassal League. Here with me is my opponent. Would you like to introduce yourself? Goes by... Um, let me see, is it Harandil on the forums? Lukas from Poland. Today I look at McCabe. Yep, so we have a McCabe versus Zareda yeah. game. Um, you see my schemes on the right hand side. You do not see my opponents, because if I could see them, that would be cheating. Um, the app determined my opponent is the attacker. He has selected the top deployment zone. Because this is symbols of authority, starting with the defender, me, we have to start placing some objectives. So I will place my first symbol marker in the bottom right corner. I will place my in the corner, mm -hmm. right corner. We are going to place one in the bottom left corner. Shouldn't be shocked <laughs> if I would like the, the top left corner. Mm -hmm. And let's see here. I think. If I go here. We're going to go and put it on the right-hand side, just outside of 8 inches north of the other one. Mm. Be sure these are uh, impassable. Yep, the strategy markers are impassable. Okay, so let's place it here. Put our last one. It's going to go right here. My last one will go here. Okay. Good stuff. So I would very much appreciate it if you could deploy McCabe and his group. Okay, so my cape will be here. You're here. Let's see. Let's place Luna here. Huckster. Okay, that's my okay. first group. All right, so now I'm going to have to put all of my frogs in. Because that's right, folks. Every frog in the game. <laughs> so we're going to go put Sarita there. Spawn mother there. I think we'll put first mate there. We'll put a willow wisp here. So actually, we'll go ahead and put spawn mother up here. A wisp up here. We'll put a wisp next to the right. Uh, we'll put a wisp down here. Put a 
Silla right there. We'll do we'll do a Silla right there. And we'll do Sillarid there. Uh, we'll move these guys up. I like to talk. I talk through my thoughts out loud, so please don't mind me. Uh, that will be my deployment. Okay, so Rough Rider will be here. He can be outside his uh, my mm -hmm. deployment, so. Jesse, maybe here, and the Huckster here, and Botanist. Okay, so let's let's see how it will go. Yes. I have seven stones. As do I. Eight models. You also have eight, so without pass tokens. Mm-hmm. Fairly even matchup as far as uh, crews go. So, I will keep this hand. I will also keep my. Okay, so let's go with initiative. Initiative. And good luck. Best and of I luck. I will start timer now. Oh boy! Oh boy! <laughs> Okay. Um, uh, I am not going to cheat. So in this case, uh, me, me neither. So let's flip again. I will not cheat, okay. so you can choose. Uh, I'll let you go first. <laughs> okay, and uh, can we... Okay. Uh, start a game in the app. Okay, so I will go with uh, probably at the beginning with uh, Luna. Mm -hmm. mm, I will drop a scrap marker. <coughs> and I will scrunch for relics. Uh, yeah. uh, so. I need uh, an 8 for this. Mm -hmm. That's an 8. Mm -hmm. So I will discard this and we'll uh, give the. Ah, okay. I need, uh, I need to cheat. So I will. Uh... No, wait. No, I will not cheat. Sorry, I don't need this. Uh, I will attach. Uh, I will attach uh, the upgrade to Luna. Mm -hmm. This will be faded mirror, and then with bonus action, um, I will try to give it to the Huckster. Oh, you okay. certainly do. So, yeah, so the Huckster will have uh, uh, this faded mirror. Mm -hmm. And that's Luna done. Okay. We will have the Spawn Mother go. Um, she is going to take a walk. <laughs> she is move six, so she's going to go one. Oh, she's not going to walk. 
And we're not going to go with her yet, because I blocked her in. <laughs> Silverid's going to go. He's going to, Silver number two, specifically. He's going to go. One, two, three, four, and five. He's going to attempt to leap. And he certainly does. And he'll just plop right there. Oh, and uh, sorry, Botanist will take uh, one growth token. From... Ah, yes, the scrap marker. Yeah. Uh, is there any condition that you don't use? Uh, I don't give out too much burning, so I think you're good to use that. Okay. And Silverade is just going to go... One, two, three, four, five. So he's right there. Okay. So now I will go with. I need to check one thing. Okay, so I will go with uh, Huckster uh, 1, mm -hmm. who have uh, this uh, mirror, so he he, uh, he has uh, fast now. Mm -hmm. uh, he will walk right here, mm -hmm. uh, interact, maybe... Oh, okay, he can interact. Uh, do the bonus action, take this to Sidir. So I need a four. That's a four. So Sidir will take uh, this mirror. And then walk again okay Here. we'll go ahead and have spawn mother go now for real this time she's gonna walk six one one two three four five and six and she's going to use her lay eggs tactical action needing a four to succeed that is not a four but that is so I will make an egg marker in base contact we'll put it back here she'll then use her second uh, general action to hatch eggs and I will be stoning for a ram in the final dual total It's not currently going off, it requires a 6, so I will cheat the 9 of rams in, and I will declare the double ram trigger large clutch when resolving. Um, so the action summons a cup into base contact with every egg marker. Large clutch, um, normally you remove the egg marker when you summon, large yeah. clutch keeps the egg marker there. So. I have Not only one, uh, as I... Yeah? Yep. Now, mm -hmm. now it's irrelevant because you have only one. Okay. Correct. <coughs> so I'll go ahead and add that in on the app. Uh, it is mindless, so you do not get a pass token this turn. Yeah. Uh, that will be the spawn mother done. Uh, mm -hmm. 
I will target this uh, ski marker with archaeological dig. Mm -hmm. I need a six. That's a six, and with the sweet I need, so I will discard this marker and put the scrap instead of this. And I will get a soul stone from mm -hmm. the trigger. Mm. Then this is an interest I need to check. And she is move five. I will copy her. Five, so I will move her here, and I will do her bonus action soulstone uh, flare. I need a seven, so let's uh, hit. That's not a seven. Mm -hmm. uh, I will cheat with this ten, so. Uh, I will place the shockwave uh, to, to hit the silurite, so take willpower 13 or take 1 damage and distract it. Just doing a quick check. Alright. Need to check if this is possible because I need to have, a, of course, yeah, but I can there do you this. Go. Well, uh, I will succeed the test, right. however. Okay, so that's her done. Okay, I will have Silurid number three go. It's going to just go one, two. Three, four, four and a half. It's going to attempt to leap. And does! And we'll go ahead and we'll plop right here in the concealing terrain. And we'll concentrate with our second action. Okay. So let's go with Rough Rider. Mm -hmm. I will try to do right with me, the targeting Huckster number two. Mm -hmm. I did it. So let's push five. Let's this here and if I have I'm moving six inches yes I am so let's try to focus and then focus shoot to the silurite okay I have a defense of five. I have a stat of five. Oh, oh it's Black Joker. Okay, so that's this Rough Rider done. And I will butterfly jump just a smidge to there. Actually, I'll stay. I'll go to just just inside the edge of the forest. We'll go there. We will have Silurid number one go. Silurid number one is going to take a walk. One, two, three, three and a half, 
four and a half and we'll just be there we will attempt to leap oh we don't this time you know what? that's fine we'll concentrate okay let's see spawn mother also have stuff unfortunately mm -hmm. let's go with lucas now probably mm. he will scrunch for relics so i will discard this corpse marker so the botanist will get another growth token mm -hmm. Rise burning, and I need uh, six for this. Yeah. That's a six. Mm, what do I want? Let's take Phantasmal Mask to him. Then let's go with ride with me. Mm -hmm. uh, I will. As I remember, the uh, size is not uh, the statistic that growth, or it is. Do you know or? Yes, so it says it gains plus one to its stats. So that does include size. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, so I will ride with me targeting no one. Mm -hmm. uh, so I need a... I need a five for this. goes off five then I will walk and I need to be within six so I will walk somewhere here Mm -hmm. and try to shoot your spawn mother mm -hmm. with net gun six against your move yep i will say that while it doesn't change my flip because this line of sight is going through the bit on the central piece of terrain I believe the tournament pack has that as cover. So your damage flip would be on a negative. Okay. Uh, so maybe if I will move like here, is it still. Let's see. Yeah, it's probably still going. Okay, so it will be minus flip. Well, only on damage. You're still on a straight to hit me. And that's probably the most important thing. And I am sitting pretty at a 15 because of move 6. I have 16. Um, you have 5 cards left. Another look at net gun, just for me. Just take a 
another look at a few things. Okay, I will allow it. So you have 15? Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's double minus? Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's take two. All right. Um, and uh, this small thing, mm -hmm. uh, how it how it called? Guts. Guts. Like Guts. A, like a guppy. Take also. I take also two. I will soulstone prevent on spawn mother. Okay. I take no damage. Okay. The gup will take two. Gain slow. Get and slow staggered. and staggered. Mm -hmm. Spawn and mother. I will push. I'm sorry, go ahead. Push you towards me. Mm -hmm. But probably it will stay uh, at this point of uh, terrain. This pipe or. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she would. This is bonk to there <clears throat> okay and that's my cape done okay uh, what to do I think I think this will be as good a time as any to go with Serena. Before we do, let's just see how, if, how close do I have to be to get a Mr. Voodoo doll who can see Lucas? Okay, so I'm going to have to Terror of Terrors, Zareda will walk. She'll go her mighty four inches. One, two, three, and four. She can see mm -hmm. Lucas. Okay. Uh, so if you cheat in line of sight to Zareda, I get to look at the top card of either player's fate deck. And Zareda is going to be trying to um, well I think the first thing she is going to do is she is going control two. Oh no, what did I do? Undo that. It's okay for me. <laughs> you can delete this model. <laughs> I'm not going for that just yet. Um, I am going to obey the Silurid number two through the spawn mother. Uh, my Silurid will relent on the obey. Okay. Uh, it will not go off because I need a seven. So I will cheat this in. The Silurid is going to take a walk action. One, two, three four and five. Then Zareda is going to obey the spawn mother who is going to relent. The spawn mother is going to I'm going to flip a card here. Uh, is that the better play? You know what? No, it's not. That is a foolish play. Instead, we're going to obey first mate arcing through the will o wisp. So we're gonna okay. draw a line say from here to go on first mate. He's going to relent. Uh, that does go off. And that is the ensorcel the trigger, trigger. Um, yeah. which we will take. The first mate is going to take a walk action. One, two, 
three, four, five, six. Is he move six? He is move six. And he is then going to take a charge action. One, two, three, four. And he's going to be charging Lucas McCabe. Boop. Uh, he'll end just within an inch of you. And he's going to swing with his anchor. Okay. Oh boy. That is a 19. That's, that is an 18. Would you like to cheat? Uh, nope. Okay. Unfortunately, this action was generated by the ensorcel trigger, so I cannot declare triggers on it. Um, yes. So it'll be a negative twist to damage. That'll be week of two. I will try to prevent. So I will take one. Okay. Let's see, you have Botanist left, you have Sadir left, you have a Huckster left. Um, that's all. That's all. Um, okay. Well, what we're going to do is I am not going to refresh hands with Sereda. I am just going to end her activation. At the end of her okay. activation, she will use Voodoo Effigy. She's going to discard this two of tomes to summon a voodoo doll into base contact. And when the voodoo doll comes in, it is going to use Wanga Mojo to attach the uh, Wanga Mojo curse onto Lucas McCabe. Right. And this will give you Linked Fate. So whenever damage or conditions happen to the Voodoo Doll, they happen to you as well. And you gain a Pass Token. Yes. Zoraida's done. Okay, so I will go with uh, Sidru now. Mm -hmm. Because he took the mirror this... Uh, this uh, round, so he will get fast. Mm -hmm. And I will go, it's only move four. One, two, three, four. Probably not within six. Ah, sorry, no, mm -hmm. but no. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but he gets focus because of swagger. Okay. He sure does. That's better, I think. So then he will move <coughs> once again. One, two, three. This is moving six, even a little bit less. And we'll try to shoot. He's Third. Oh, first I will do his bonus action. Mm -hmm. uh, the four, blow it to hell. So I will place. Oh, I didn't took this marker. Uh, blown apart marker. Mm -hmm. mm. This within eight, so I will place this somewhere here <laughs> and then I will spend my focus to shoot the first mate sounds good <clears throat> if he's machine gun and you are going to get around friendly fire with that yeah so it'll be a straight flip for you yes okay so now I have 16. I currently <coughs> have grief, a 7. Grief reflexes. I am going to cheat to an 18. To 
check something. Okay. Twenty eighteen. Mm -hmm. I will go to nineteen with uh, delay trigger. Okay. The first mate will gain slow, and this is uh, he has he got uh, hard to want. He does not. So this but is straight free. Do you want to use soul I stones? Do. You will be on a negative, sir. So this is negative. Okay. So we'll take two. Uh, you know what? I'll go ahead and stone to prevent that as well. I take no damage. But still going slow. I do. I then butterfly jump and go one, two, three. That's it, you're done. Mm -hmm. Okie dokie. I have a Willow Wisp number two. The Willow Wisp has moved five, an engagement range of two. So it is going to charge the Voodoo doll to there. And it will use Distracting Illusion on the Voodoo Doll, who will relent. It will succeed. The Voodoo Doll gains Stunned and Distracted 1. And because of Wangamojo, McCabe gains those as well. We are then going to do the same thing on the voodoo doll. He's going to relent again. It'll go off again. So you effectively just get another stack of distracted on McCabe. Okay. And that's the Will-O-Wisp. Okay, so let's go with uh, Botanist now. Mm -hmm. Botanist will... I have his stat card. We'll go with Onward. Mm -hmm. So... I need a 6 for this, that's a 6, I will take walk action, and this will be walk 6, mm -hmm. so what should I do? Section, then I will charge the Silurid. Okay. Uh, he hasn't got uh, any uh, his guys or something like this, only butterfly jump and stealth, right? Correct. One, two, oh. A little different. Three, four, five, six, and let's go six against your defense. Sounds good. I have a thirteen. Now I have twelve, but let's see. I will go to. Eighteen with a uh, tasty snack uh, trigger. Okay. Um, before you flip, I you are you're in line of sight to Zoraida, so she saw you. So I will look at the top card of your deck with eyes in the with reading the cards. 
Okay. I will discard that card. And okay. now go ahead and uh, do your damage flip. So I have 18 to your 13, right? Mm -hmm. So negative twist. Negative. Take one damage. Takes one. And staggered. Mm -hmm. And injured. Mm -hmm. And I have one more growth token. Mm -hmm. And staggered prevents movement from friendly effects, but I don't think it prevents it from itself. Uh, from effects of other friendly mobs. Uh, yeah, it's, I think it's only from other. Yeah. So I will be going one, or butterfly jumping, one, two, three, and being out of your engagement. Okay, so I will try to do his flesh eating spores. Mm -hmm. uh, I need a four for this because he has also these stats uh, mm -hmm. better. So I will place a shockwave marker near your silurid. So you need to take move 12, okay. 12 or, or take damage and injured one. Well, uh, I will fail because it's staggered. Yeah. So take one damage and another one injure, mm -hmm. which probably is not. OK. OK, so that's the botanist. Mm -hmm. I think you just have the huckster left, is that correct? Huckster left, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. OK. Well, first mate technically hasn't gone yet because he was obeyed into position by Zereda and then you went and slowed him. Yes. So he is going to attempt to leap. And you know what? He doesn't get it, which is a shame. So then he's going to try and just bonk McCabe with the anchor. Okay. That is a seven. That is more than seven. Sure is. It's, it's He's eleven seven. for now. Mm -hmm. um, he is no longer. Okay. Here, so. so. I am not cheating. That's first mate's activation. Okay, so let's go with the last huckster. Mm hmm. Who will? Uh, walk and try to do, or maybe let's go to do save speech on this silurid number three. Mm -hmm. uh, you have concealment, so I will have uh, this is dual against willpower. Mm -hmm. And it'll be on a negative unless you focus. No, uh, this is on negative. It's no problem. So I'm currently on 12. I'm on 16. Okay, this doesn't go off, so I will go secret passage. I will I need butterfly the jump. Ah, okay. I need a knight, so I need to. I need to cheat it. It's Twelve. So I will place here. Mm -hmm. And that's Huckster done. Yes, indeed. I think I have a Willow Wisp left, and that Wisp is going to. 
take a walk or fly rather to about here and it will try to lure your huckster towards it stat 5 against your willpower Okay. I have an 11. I have 9, so I will not cheat. I do not meet my target number of 12, and I will not cheat. Okay. I have a voodoo doll left. Um, the voodoo doll... I'm sorry, do you have anyone else to activate? Nope. Okay. Voodoo doll is going to go. Non bonus tactical actions. It doesn't attach an upgrade or list a model by a name. Okay, so I can't copy anything of value off of McCabe. But what I can do is I will attempt to jinx McCabe. Stat four against your willpower. Willpower of five. Mm -hmm. I am on a negative because I also have uh, distracted. So I have a 11 against your willpower. I have 14. That will fail. I will try it again. Ooh, got that red joker. Oh. 18. 13. So it goes off. All right, negative twist. So one whole damage and injured one, which don't bother because it goes away. Yeah, I will take damage. Okay, that'll be the voodoo doll done. And I think that's going to be me done. Okay, so that's the turn, I think. That is. Um, do you have any end of turn shenanigans? I don't think I do. Other than, of course, injured going away. Won't have, probably. There we go. Reshuffle, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. I will discard this card and draw my hand. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. I will discard this one and this two mm -hmm. and draw my We're in turn two. Okay, okay. I have plus one to the initiative. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Here we go. Um, do you wish to stone for cards? I'm sorry. Okay. I have a five. I have nine plus one. Nine plus one. Hmm. You still cheat. You know, I don't think I do. You may have okay. it. Okay. Okay, so I will start and I will uh, do from Flash with Cash from Bot Botanist. Mm -hmm. I will I like to discard three cards and draw to the full hand. And I will start with who I want to start. If there will be no distracted, I will of course start with my cape. Mm -hmm. Because of his distracted, I don't know if this is the best things I think I can do. So maybe I will start with Botanist. I will charge. Somewhere here. Okay. Let's go with.
Yes, uh, it's six against your defense. I currently have a 14. I have a 15. I will not cheat. Mm, I will also not cheat. Okay. Good. One damage. One injured and still staggered. And not no injured. Oh, okay. Because I have no trigger, so only staggered. But you are already have staggered. Okay. I will. Do you want to do butterfly jump? I will. I will butterfly jump just out of your engagement. Okay. So in this case, I will do my bonus action onward. I need a six for this. This is not a six, so I will cheat in. Mm -hmm. and go a little bit closer. Mm -hmm. And try to hit you once more. Uh, yeah. I have 13 now. I am currently at a 9. I will go ahead and f cheat to a 14. 14. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will go to f 15. Okay. I will look at the top and card of, because you cheated in Zareda's line of sight. I'll look at the top card of your deck. And you know what? Probably, yes. Um, I'll discard that. Okay. So this is still uh, minus, and now you will gain injured mm -hmm. because of trigger. And it's two damage. Wow. Three sixes in a row. Nice. Boop. Again, injured. And I am not going to bother butterfly jumping. Yeah, unfortunately. Only one damage need to be done mm -hmm. more. Okay, uh, and I got another growth token. And that's the botanist. Nice. So I'll go with the Sillarid because, as you point out, uh, it's almost dead. Yeah. Um, the Sillarid is going to. Oh, I'm sorry. At the start of the turn, I have two more models than I started the game with. So you should have two pass tokens. Yeah. Um, I am going to have my Sillarid. Take a leap action, the one that Sillery number two. Uh, excuse me, I'm burping. Aw, oh, does not go off. So I'll cheat this in. It is going to go right here in base contact with your symbol. And to the shock of nobody, it's going to eat the symbol marker for the strategy point. And perhaps not to the shock of many people. It is also going to take an action to interact and drop a scheme marker under there, on your side of the board. Okay. Uh, it is Underneath? The... Okay, but I still can have a line of sight to this marker? Because... Yes. 30 millimeters can't block line of sight to yeah. it's very hard to do that so um, you will be able to see it yeah. it's just further yeah. away from you okay okay so let's go with uh, oh that's right because you got uh, a botanist right here um, you know what that's a good point we'll leave it there anyway what the hey? Okay. So I will go with 
Rough Rider now. Mm -hmm. And we'll try to shoot the Silurid. Okay. I am at an 11. I need to flip. Currently, I'm. Ten. Mm -hmm. So I will cheat. Uh, you have seventeen with crit strike. Yes. Seventeen with crit strike to my eleven. So that would put you on a straight flip. Hmm. It's two, three, four. So now it's three, four, three, four five. You said th 17. I will go to an 18. Okay, so that will miss. And I am going to butterfly jump. Uh, we'll go one, two, three. Okay, so I will try I do with me. I need a seven. Go on. Uh, I will move him a little bit closer. Mm -hmm. And we'll shoot you again. I will spend my focus defensively. I'm on 15. I am currently on an 11. I will not cheat. I will also not cheat. So it's negative. Mm -hmm. Take two. Takes two. I will butterfly jump and I will go one, two, and three. Ending engaged with you. Okay. But I don't think you're engaging me because I think you have a zero inch engage. Yeah. He has zero. Yep. Okay. Cool beans. Um. So that's your rough rider. Uh, what do we want to do? Kind of feel like. It might be Zoraida time. So, I'll Zoraida go. Uh, Zoraida is going to uh, she's going to use her first action She's going to use Voodoo Pins on the Voodoo Doll, who will relent. I will hit. Shocker. Uh, three cards, pick the worst. That's weak. The Voodoo Doll takes a point of damage. So McCabe takes a point of damage. Okay. And Voodoo Doll gains injured. So McCabe gains a point of injured. She is then going to uh, use Hex on McCabe, arcing through the first mate. Stat 6 against your willpower. 6 against 4. Mm -hmm. I currently have a 14. I will go to 16. Uh, 16, you say? I will go ahead and I'll go to an 18 and is first mate injured? He is not. So I'm not going to bother with the trigger. Um, but it will hit and I will um, now do my damage flip. 2, 3, 4 damage. So negative twist. Do you want a stone for another negative or nah? No, no, one negative. Okay, moderate three. I will stone to prevent. Mm -hmm. 
We went two. All right. And you'll gain another injured. Zoraida will then obey the first mate, who will relent. I will cheat in the 13 of masks and declare the ensorcel trigger. So he takes two actions and he's going to swing on McCabe. Okay. First swing. Oof, that's an 8. 15. That will miss. I will swing again with my ensorcel trigger. Oh, geez, that's a 9. I will cheat to, oh, to a 9. Alright, that'll be a double negative to damage. And hey, lucky Maybe. moderate for 3 damage. I will stone for... So I will take one. Okay. Um, Zareda will then use Threads of Fate. We both discard our hands and draw back up to full. Okay, so I will discard this too. Ah, uh, I keep forgetting I can see you and you cheat, so I should get to look at cards. I keep forgetting that. Zareda is done. Okay, so... I do. Probably in this case I will go with McCabe. Okay. I will start with Ride With Me. Mm -hmm. I need uh, five for this. And because you're stunned, this counts as one of your actions. Yeah. And uh, uh, as he has uh, Phantasmal Mask, mm -hmm. he has also Life Lead. Uh, ah, okay, but an enemy, okay. Uh, okay, so... Um, it doesn't go off. I need a 5, so it will go off. Mm -hmm. I will look so at the top card of go. your deck with Zareda. And okay. I would discard that. I will go one, two, three, four. And I will move. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or maybe not like this. Six, seven. Then I will move. I will move again. Yes. One, two, three, four. And that's my cape done. Okay. He's no longer stunned. Mm -hmm. We are going to have the Will O Wisp bottom right is going to uh, let's see you're manipulative with hucksters, aren't you? Yes. Um well and you can secret passage while well engaged. Yes, but I need to be within one of blocking terrain. Mm -hmm. uh, but if you will charge me, I'm, I will be still. Correct. To do secret passage. That is the predicament. Let's see. Ah, symbols are blocking impassable, but they, I'm sorry, they're concealing impassable, but they're not blocking. So you cannot jump to them with secret passage. That's good to know. Unfortunately not. So in that case, I think the Will-O-Wisp is going to simply go one, two, three, four, five, and charge one, two, three, four, five. 
and we'll take a negative twist on its attempt to distracting illusion you. It's against willpower? It is. I have a five total. More than five. Yep. That's okay. Willow Wisp is done. Okay, so let's go with this Huckster number two. Mm -hmm. uh, I need to check this Willow Wisp. It has. Right. Oh, if I will start my activation, I will need to, oh, I need to discard the card. So yes, I will discard this one to not gain a stand. A stand. Mm -hmm. And oh, then no. I will... Uh, it's only if you're engaging my model, not if my model engages you. Ah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I thought that it is... Uh, ah, okay. Yes. Okay, so I will try to do my bonus action, so it's 5 against your willpower. Mm -hmm. Willpower 4. Ooh, I have a 15. I will go to 16. All right, real quick. I can see your Huckster with Zerada because the Will-O-Wisp and the Gups are size one. I'm sorry, the Will-O-Wisp is okay. size two. I lied. Make sure. Okay, so you... Yep, I don't have line of sight. Never mind. Okay. I will not cheat. So... Okay, so let's discard the top card of our decks. All right. Mine's a 12. Okay, so you can take this card to your hand and I will gain Soulstone. Oh, thank you. I'll get rid of this one of crows. Then I will walk. Three, four, five, and another walk. One, two, three. Okay. That's Huckster done. I'm sorry. Um when you, you we we should have done a disengaging strike when you tried ah, to leave. Okay. Yeah. Um, right. Sorry, this is my. I didn't remember that. Will of Wisp has. Oh, so maybe uh, let's do this. Uh, not. Okay, so let's do disengage. All right. Uh, you technically s still have your manipulative bonus because of how the yeah. FAQ went. So I'm on negatives here. Oh. Take Black Joker. Well, okay. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And your def your willpower My is five. 5. So it is a straight flip for the disengage. Yes. Um, I will go ahead and throw that severe you gave me in and reduce your push by 6. Okay, so I will not... So let's do this once more. Mm -hmm. Well, you get it that time. Uh, so let's go. One, two, three, four. Okay. <laughs> what okay, so do? that's Huckster done. Yep. Um, you have Sadir, Jesse, Luna, and Huckster left. Yes. Hmm. 
You have two pass tokens, courtesy of me. I'm going to shrink his aura. What do I want to do here? I think... I will I think I will go with the first mate. The first mate is going to take a walk action. One, two, three, four, five, and six. He is going to attempt a leap, I think. Ah, uh, just out. Well, then I guess. Actually, what we'll do is, aha, uh -huh, that's what we'll do. Get out of here, model. First mate is going to clear a charge. One, two, three, four, five. He'll get it here. And he's going to bonk Sadir with his anchor. Okay. Currently 10. I am currently on a 9. And what we're going to do is cheat the 12 of masks in and go to a 18. Okay, so I will go to 17. Okay, I will declare Pouncing Strike. Uh, first we do the neg the damage flip. Uh, Sadir is not hard to wound, correct? No. Okay. Um, single negative. That'll be weak of two. Okay, take two. I then place in base contact with a enemy model within five inches in line of sight of first mate. So I'll place next to McCabe, engaging McCabe and Luna. I take the attack uh, uh, action targeting the enemy model I place next to, so I'm going to bonk McCabe. Okay. That is uh, 18. 14. I will not cheat. Okay. Negative twist. Oh, hit Red Joker for six. No. Really? Yep. Okay, I will stone. Mm -hmm. So I will get four. Mm -hmm. And then first mate will do his bonus action leap. He is going to throw a stone into the mask. Um, here we go. It is not it is going off currently, but I will cheat the ram in, so I get sudden strike as well. I'm going to just place myself back here, so I'm not engaged by Luna, but I am engaging Luna, and I am going to take a swing on McCabe with the okay attack from Sudden Strike. I have a 14. I have a 16. Alright, uh, that will fail, unfortunately. But okay. I did cheat on his activation, so I will draw a card from Showboat. And he's done. 
Okay, so let's go with Jesse. Mm -hmm. we go one, two, three. Uh, three. Four, five. Mm -hmm. Five, I think. Hope. Yeah. And I will try to do uh, archaeological dig. So I need the six. Mm -hmm. That's a six. So I will remove your. Uh, I will drop scrap marker and remove your skin marker. Mm -hmm. There we go. I grabbed it for you. About trigger. Okay. Then I will do Soulstone Flare. I need a 7. That's a 7. So I will place Shockwave and you need to do Willpower 13. Mm -hmm. Or I, I need a 9. Take damage. I get it. Okay, so that's Jesse done. That silver has been very lucky against your flares. Yeah. Um, I think I am going to have my spawn mother activate. The spawn mother is going to lay eggs on a four. She does. So she's just going to plop that right there. Uh, she's going to hatch eggs, and I am going to munch a stone for a ram here. Um, it does not go off. It needs just one more, so I will cheat for it to go off. I get two more gups. Unfortunately, I no longer have... Um, I don't get the trigger. So all my... Eggies go bye bye. I'll put an eggy boy here and an eggy boy here. And doot, doot, doot. These go to here. Uh, she has one more action, and her last action is going to be um, nourish the young, needing a six. It goes off, um, so all friendly gups within six inches heal two, and all conditions, and gain focus. Okay. That's the spawn mother. Okay, so now I will go with. I will go with Cedir probably. Mm -hmm. Twelve. Let's see. Oh, not two. Not aura of twelve. So let's go. One, two, three, four. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so he gain focus. Mm -hmm. And I will try to shoot. We focus uh, the voodoo doll. Sounds good. My voodoo doll is at a six to resist. I have eight, uh, 14, sorry. Mm -hmm. I am not going to cheat. Uh, me neither, so this will be positive. Mm -hmm. Let's focus. So, Voodoo Doll will take six, mm -hmm. and Zoraida and Will of Wisp will get will take three. Yep, yep. Will of Wisp so takes that. And Cape will take one mm -hmm. because of upgrade. The Voodoo Doll dies. He loses his upgrade, or uh, correct. 
Uh, I believe the way it works is... Oh, actually, hold the phone. Uh, if this model is killed, just call all through new upgrades attached to enemy models. Yep, you're good. Ah, okay, so this is on, on Voodoo Doll, right? Yep, so McCabe is no longer uh, under the curse of the Voodoo. Yeah, okay, so... That is... Uh, oh, uh, no, that... I didn't take uh, the bonus action, so now I will discard a card for Juggernaut. Mm -hmm. So I will heal full. Okay. And that's it, you're done. Okie dokie. Well, I'll have the gup that's down here go. It's going to activate and look at its card and it's going to attempt to leap it needs a three of masks that is not a three of masks but this is so it is they also have sleep All of my frogs have leap. Yeah, unfortunately. Um, and we're going to go ahead and just go one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. And it's going to be there. And then we get rid of the original. Boop. Okay, so I will go with Luna. Mm -hmm. Which will do. Which will uh, assist McCabe. Mm -hmm. So, uh, to get rid of distracted, I think this is assist can, can yes. take distracted out. Correct. Yeah. Okay, so I need to flip how much? One. And I will do this once more. Mm -hmm. So he's no longer distracted. Seems good. I will have the will o wisp. It is going to flap over to. Let's see. You know what? It's going to flap over to here to hide away from your nasty guns. Yes, buddy? My dog wants to say hi to everyone. Uh, what do we want to do? What do we want to do? Yeah, I think we'll go here and, well, no, that's actually not doing anything with him. So I will go here. That's what we'll do. I'll go here and I will attempt to lure Zareda. She will relent. Needs a seven. And you know what? That'll fail. And that's fine. will o -Wisp is done. Okay, so only hacker left for me. So hmm. what what won't I do? Let's go with Hackster and Oh, 
One, two, three, four, and a little bit. Char let, let's charge uh, the first mate. Okay. Five against your uh, defense. I'm at 16. Mm. Okay, so let's go to 17. 17? I will allow it. I will not cheat. Mm, with the trigger shady dealings. Okay. So, uh, is he hard to wound? He is not. So it's single minus. Mm -hmm. Take two. Okay. It will take two, and I believe it's discard a random card, correct? For each of my unrevealed schemes? Uh, for each of unrevealed schemes, so I let's would. discard two. There we go. I will butterfly jump away. Um, I don't know why you dragged the one out of the deck. Uh, sorry, I, want, I wanted to check... Uh, the other card that you discarded. Ah. Sorry. That's all good. Alright. So, okay. I will butterfly jump out of your engagement by going there. Okay. So let's try save speech uh, with negatives. Mm hmm. This is against willpower. That is okay, thirteen. This doesn't go up. You you can battle battle. Uh, yeah, I'll go to there. Yeah. And let's go. Ok. Hacks they're done, and I believe that's all of my models. Okay. Uh, we'll have Silurid 3 activate. Silurid 3 is going to attempt to leap. Needing a 3. Getting a 3. And we're going to go right here. And we're going to go... One, two, three, four, well, something like one, two, one, up one, over one, so three, four, five. So I'll end there and I'll concentrate. My last action. And other Silurid is going to go. Other Silurid is going to attempt to leap. Black Joker. So he is going to go one, two out of the forest. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. And he'll go there. Um, that's going to be everybody for me. At the okay. end of the turn, uh, I will score the sim the strategy. And I am going to reveal. Catch and release on Silurid number three. Okay. Because he's engaging uh, a henchman and not engaging yes. any other enemy. Do you reveal anything? Nope. Okie dokie. On we go into turn three. I'll keep this hand. Mm, 
shuffle. I will not. Uh, uh, I will stone for cards. Mm -hmm. I will discard this free and this free. And let's go for initiative. Yeah. Oh boy, I have a two. I have three plus two. Plus two. Would you oh. like to cheat? Hmm. Would I? I think. Let me see. Based on how you said that, I think I would like to. I have a red joker. Okay, so I will still win. Okay. Because I have 15. Mm -hmm. Now, how many models do you have? I have still 8, I think. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, yeah. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4. You have 1, 2, three. You have I, 11. Yep. Mm -hmm. So I have three pass tokens and I will start with Lucas. Okay. Be before he dies, let's go and try to hit the first mate. Alrighty. I have a 12. I have 15. Yes, you do. I will not cheat. I will also not cheat. So, first, I will do my damage, which is 2. Yep, I take 2. And I, I will push myself inches like this. Uh, just to be here so now you you need to take uh, you need to take move 13 duel mm -hmm. and let's see I think I will look at your card. It's defense. Uh, so this is the move bit. Uh, suffers two. Uh, I'll take two. Make way. Yep. I take two. Uh, and you you can take butterfly jump before my uh, before don't... my. I don't think so. Trigger or, or after? I think it's after your trigger. Okay, so now you need to take TN 13 duel, uh, defense duel, or suffer two damage. I'm fine, I flipped 12. Because of the re mm -hmm. And now you can butterfly if you want. I do. I would like to be out of your engagement. You cannot because it's two inches. Well, I would like to be a little bit further out of your engagement. Um, one, two, and a half. We'll go there. Okay, so I will try to hit you once more. Mm -hmm. Now it's 18, uh, 18. And I have a six. I will allow it. 18 to six will give you a positive twist to damage. So, take three damage. Uh, okay, that will kill. And I can push myself two inches in any direction. One, two. Mm -hmm. was second action mm. third action I will try to ride with me 
I need a five for this. Mm -hmm. We'll go off. One, two, three, four, five. Now I will charge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll charge here. Okay. So these gaps need to take TN13 move duel. They fail. Or gain or take two damage. They take two damage. And I will try to hit him. They'll with spend my bull whip. They'll spend their focus. Red Joker. Yep. I have a oh. thirteen. Twenty. So that'll be a straight flip. And I will declare like the wind trigger. Mm -hmm. So take two damage. They die. Blap. And pulse. I will pulse inches from my uh, attack. Mm -hmm. Then uh, I can do five. So I will go one, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. And then Siluri need to take. TN13 move dual or take two damage. It'll take two damage. And that's my cape done. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. I'll have Silverid number two activate. He's going to take a walk. He's no longer injured. Boop. One, two, three, four. Actually, he'll just go ahead and take a charge on Jesse. Okay. Uh, so this will be stat 5 against your defense. Sharp claws. I have a 10. I have 9. I will go to 11. Uh, okay. That'll fail. I will leap. Uh, not currently leaping. There I am. <laughs> We'll go here, and then we will pick up a symbol marker. Okay. And that is going to be that silver done. So I will go with Huckster. Mm -hmm. uh, this Huckster number two, mm -hmm. which will sail speech on Wheel of the, the Wisp. Okay. Five against your willpower. Ooh, seventeen. Okay, that's that's okay for me. And I will move and pick up this symbol. Seems good. Okie dokie. What do we want to do? I think Seems like a good enough time for... Um, We'll do Zerada. Zerada is going to start by obeying Spawn Mother, who will relent. Not currently going off. There it is with Insorcel. And Spawn Mother is going to take a walk action. Two, three, five, six. And then she will take a charge action. The intent is to end her engaging Sadir, but within line of sight of Zareda. Uh, okay. And she's going to take her swing on Sadir. 
This is stat six against your defense. Here is the defense of six. Got me a 19. I will cheat. I will cheat. Uh, to a 15. Okay. I will you since you cheated in her line of sight, she's gonna look at top card of my deck. I'll keep it. Negative twist to damage. Okay. I will let you goes to two damage. Okay. Zareda is going to discard her hand in your hand and everyone draw a fresh hand of cards. Okay, so this was good move because of two elevens and ten. Mm -hmm. Um, let's see. How do we want to do this? Okay, so this was bonus, right? That was her bonus. Yes. She has two okay. more actions. And I think what she's going to do is going to if I lose her that's kind of okay so I think I'm gonna target McCabe arcing through spawn mother with hex okay. and I will be stoning for positive to get around your concealment Okay. This go. is not. Uh, this is uh, not the projectile. Uh, that is correct. Okay. Hex is uh, just a twelve-inch six against willpower attack. Okay, so six against my five. I have a nine I'm currently. Currently seventeen. I will go to an eighteen. Eighteen. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will let it go. Uh, so okay. this is uh, two, three, four damage and injured. Fortunately, yes. But uh, okay, let's see how it will go with single negative. With moderate no. three. Okay, I will try to stone this. Mm -hmm. So we'll take one. Mm -hmm. And gain injured one. And gain injured one. Yes. And what we're going to do is we will now try to obey my Cillarid through Spawn Mother, who relents. Okay. Uh, it's not currently going off. I would cheat for it to go off. He will then take a swing on McCabe with his melee action, and he will spend his focus to do so. Okay. Step five against your defense. I am currently at a 17. I will go to 18. That will miss. Okay. Um, that's with uh... injured. Yes. Okay. He, he. Oh, I will. I will double check this, but I think he's normally a yeah, defense of six. So now mm -hmm. with thirteen is eighteen. Seems good. Uh, Zareda is going to enter activation by discarding a card and summoning a voodoo doll. So you'll gain a pass token, and it's going to put its Wanga Mojo curse onto Sadir. Okay. Unfortunately, I'll go ahead and I'll actually use the uh, hemmed additional trigger condition to remember. Uh, that'll be Zareda done. Okay, so before Sidir will get distracted, I will go with him. You will discard a card because now you are engaged with. Oh, no, never mind. I don't have any of the stinky models next to you. Yeah. 
and Sidir will try to hit your spawn mother mm -hmm. with his sword. So six against your defense. I have a fifteen. I have seventeen. Yes, you do. I will not cheat. Okay, so let's go with take two. Takes two. I will swing again. She's at eleven. Mm. I will go to uh, 18 with Bloody Fate. 18? I'm at 11. You'd be on a straight flip. That's fine, but I will look at the top card of your deck and I will discard it. Okay, so take. Currently? Take, 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 take three. Takes three. I will look at the top card I of your will... deck. I will discard it. Uh, okay, so I will draw a card and discard the card because you were not killed. Mm -hmm. And then I will discard the card to Juggernaut. Oh, oh and Black Jugger. Okay. That happens. Yeah, but better now than for something that can be more relevant. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. I think that's CD you're done. Seems about right. Uh, let's see here. Um, what to do? Well, I guess we'll go with Will-O-Wisp number two. He's just going to go and declare a charge and just move ever so gently up to here. And he's going to use his attack on the, on the Voodoo doll, who will relent. And I will hit coordinated attack. So I will declare coordinated attack. First things first, though. Um, Sadir is going to gain distracted and stunned. Distracted and stunned. And Zareda will be my nominated friendly model. She's going to poke the Voodoo Doll with a pin. Voodoo Doll will relent. Goes off. Voodoo Doll will take one damage and gain injured. And I will take one. I will get injured. Mm -hmm. And then the Will O Wisp will do it again, distracting Illusion on Voodoo Doll, who relents. And I am actually going to cheat in the One of Crows here, and I will declare the delay trigger. So you will gain slow and another distracted. Right, distracted. And. Oh. And that'll be the Will O Wisp. Okay. So now I will go with uh, Rough Rider. Mm -hmm. We'll try to shoot Silurit. Okay. It's five against your defense. Mm-hmm. Currently at a nine. A thirteen. Uh, we'll go to sixteen. Sixteen. Okay. That will miss. I will butterfly jump. And, and I will go one, two, three. So I am engaging you in melee, so you cannot take the gun action. Okay, so I will ride with me. Mm -hmm. It will go off. I will go... Oh, maybe... 
somewhere here. Maybe not, maybe five, uh, five inches. So I will go somewhere here and we'll try to shoot you again. Mm -hmm. Now with positive because you are not correct. So I'm at it 11. will be it will be sixteen with crit strike. Mm -hmm. Um, I will take it. Uh, you'll be on a negative. Take three. Takes three, and I will butterfly jump. Okay. That's Rough Rider done. Mm -hmm. Let's see, you have Huckster, you have Luna, you have Jesse and Botanist. Botanist. Okay. I think. I think I will have. Um, What do I want to do? I think I'll have Willow Wisp go. And Willow Wisp is going to go one, two, three. Basically, is going to charge and end here. So going to try and smack your huckster with some distracting illusions. Four against willpower. You are no longer manipulative. So 13 against willpower? 14. Okay, that'll fail. Wisp is done. So I will go with huckster number one. Mm -hmm. I will secret passage. I need a knight. That's not a knight. So I will cheat. I will go here. And I will try to hit your Silurid. Okay. Silurid has a 16 defense. Okay, I will miss. I will butterfly jump. One, two, and three. So, uh, I know that you will get the symbol probably in this case. Uh, so I will try to sales pitch on you. Okay. It's willpower. I have a 17. I have not. Butterfly so, job. That's the hackster number one. Mm -hmm. Let's see, you have Luna and Jesse left. And yeah, and plant, and botanist, plant boy. Um, yeah. We will have. I think Silverid number three is going to go. It is going to leap. He does. And he's going to be declaring a charge. All right. I'm gonna one, two, three, four. He's gonna pet Luna with great vigor and pointy claws. Suspending my focus. I am currently 8. I am currently at 15 with Infect. Okay, I, I will not do anything, so let's go. 8 to 15 is a straight, goes to positive because of focus. Yeah. 
Uh, that'll be moderate of three plus an inj uh, plus a poison. Okay. Um. Let's see. Luna has a zero inch engage, but she can still do things. So I'll go ahead and I'll just punch Luna again. Okay. And that's going to be a 11. 15. That's fine. Sailor Raid is done. Okay, so let's go with Luna. Try to disengage. I will try and keep you here. That is a 16. 11, so it's minus. Uh, two fewer inches, please. Okay, I can do this in any di direction that I want, right? Mm -hmm. So it will be four. So I will go here to be in base contact with your silurit. Okay. Uh, and Luna will die, unfortunately, you dog killer. It's, so uh, I will try to. Those frogs are hungry, man. So I will try to bite you. I would try to not be bitten, but I'm not doing so good on that. I am at a uh, 7. I am at 10. Uh, if you're ahead. coming with me, trigger. Oh dear. Uh, you know what? Go Fortunately, ahead. Fortunately, I need to push you first. Okay, so it's minus. Ha. Black Joker. So I will push you to it. Mm -hmm. I see myself here. All right. And I will. You can butterfly. Yep. yep. One. Two, three. Okay, so not now your turn. That is my Silurid. All right, that's and it's also Luna's turn because she just went. Ah, yeah, th this was Luna. Um, oh, uh, she didn't do a bonus though. She has no bonus. Oh, my bad. Um. I will go, I guess, with Gups number two. It's going to try and leap. Uh, it does not, I don't think. Gups are babies. They're not the best at jumping. No, it needed a three. Womp womp. So it's going to go up one, over two, three, and then it's going to just climb down and be there. Okay, so I will go with Jessie. She will try her flare mm -hmm. against Silurit. Uh, we'll see again. Yeah. Uh, so I will place it somewhere near the Silurid, so willpower 13. Uh, currently failing. Um, I am going to go ahead and cheat. So I will pass. Be passing, okay. So I will try to hit you with harpoon gun. Okay. I am at 15. I am at a 14. I think you got me. 
Uh, so, because Black Joker already gone, so it will be 2 damage. Yep. And the, f the second action will be move. 1, 2, 3. That's Jesse. Okay. We are going to have my Gups go. My other Gups. Oh. Yeah. They're going to go one, two, th three, four. They're going to try and leap. They don't. And they'll go one, two, three, and four. I have Voodoo Doll and Spawn Mother and one Silverid left. Okay, so let's go with Botanist will be my last model, I think. Mm -hmm. So I will try to do onward. I need a four. It's a four, so I will walk. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then I will walk. One, two, three, four, five, six. I will charge these gaps. One, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I need to check his card. Sure. He has zero in the engagement and has no butterfly jump, so a little bit outside zero. And they'll spend their focus defensively. Okay, so I'm currently at 18. I'm at 14. I will not cheat because I can't. And uh, the trigger is by my eye, so it will be plus one damage mm -hmm. and push you free away of, from me. Uh, so it will be negative, I think. Right? Because, Correct. Yeah. Oh, it will be two damage. And I push three away, you say? Yeah. I bonk uh, into the symbol. Push up to three, so a little, so to be still in my engagement. Ah, okay. Right. But the oh, here, somewhere here. Uh, and that's button is done. Okay. And you have nothing else, correct? Yes. All right. Silverid yes. is going to try and leap. Succeeds. Is going to place. Undo that. We're going to do this. We're going to place here. We're going to. Take an action to drop a scheme marker. Mm -hmm. And we're going to put it right here. And we're going to take an action to concentrate. Then, okay. um, you have nothing else to activate. We'll have the voodoo doll go. It is going to take a walk. As a move of four, but it's just going there, and it's going to try and jinx Sadir. I have distracted, so I'm on negatives. Uh, so that is a seven to your willpower. He's injured, so I think you still dodge it. Probably as his will. Yeah, so it's eight. Oh, I'm sorry. I was slow as well, so I shouldn't have even done that. Um, so we can put those back in our decks and shuffle, or we can just go on. That's my bad. Uh, we can go on. I apologize. Um, that's Similar cards to 
good. Doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, doll's d- uh, done, so just spawn mother. Uh, she is going to... Let's see. Uh, she's going to try and... Try and lay eggs. She does. She'll put them here. And then she's going to try menacing talons on Sadir. Stat 6 against your defense. I have a 15. I have uh, less because it's 12. Okay, I'll declare. I I will declare infect. I have a crow in the suit and a crow built in, so it's two poison to you. Okay. Negative damage is moderate three. I will stone. So it's one. Okay. And two poison. Mm-hmm. Right. Correct. And I will punch you again. I have a ten. More than ten. Oh, you got me this time. Well. Spawn mother will be done. I think that's going to be the end of my activations for the turn. Okay. Uh, so at the end of the turn, I will score the strategy, as will you. Yes. And you will reveal breakthrough, I think. You are correct. And I will reveal, I think, let them bleed. Because uh, now spawn mother and seal uh, read. Mm-hmm. Are the most costed models from your site, and you have one silurite with with only one wound. That is correct. You do. Very good play. <coughs> um, going into turn four, uh, if it is all right, I would like to take a, sh- yes. a five-minute break. Um, okay, so I will pause our uh, timer. We have almost one hour left. Okay. I will pause the recording now. All right, and we're back from that break. Um, Okay. The timer goes off, so now Luna dies. She goes pop. And Sadir goes down to four. Cape is no longer injured, Sidir is no longer in- injured. Voodoo Doll is also no longer injured. We'll go ahead and clear our moved. Here and Sidir had. And. Okay. Look at that. So, shuffle, oh, reshuffle, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Reshuffle, I will discard this one. Okay. Draw hand. I will stone for cards. Mm -hmm. Discard this three and this three. Seems good. Now I have plus four to initiative because of plus token. <laughs> yes, indeed. Here we go. Well, so I will. I will not cheat. Uh, neither will I. Steam. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. My breakthrough marker had to go away. Let's put that down there. Uh, okay. New pass tokens. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine models to your one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. seven. So you'll get two pass tokens. Okay, I will start. So I will go with alternate, I think. Uh, check. I I up need to restart, unfortunately. 
Okay, let's go. Uh, with botanist, is it? Mm. Okay, let's start with botanist and let's try to hit these gaps. Mm -hmm. Gaps are at an 11. I had uh, 12. Okay, you got him. Uh, so if you will not cheat, I will cheat to 14 and to plus one damage. Okay, I will look at the top card of your deck because you cheated. And I'll let you keep it. So it's uh, minus. Mm -hmm. It's two damage. Still enough to kill. Uh, and Gups don't drop corpses when they die. And Ever, I will go... Uh, you killed a Gup, but not within six inches of Spawn Mother. So, please continue. I will go with Onward. Which will go off. Mm -hmm. And I will move one two, three, four, four, five, six. Careful, I think you have to enter my engagement when you move that way. Ah, okay. I forgot that it's two inches. Yeah, no worries. Uh, can you uh, put this around and we will see? Yes, okay, so I will go here, mm -hmm. just onward, and pick up this marker. Yes, indeed. I will uh, then, I guess I will go. Um, I will go with the Silurid number three. He is going to go one, two, three, four, five. He is going to pick up this marker. And then he is going to leap. He does. And he's going to run away oh so bravely. Into the trees. Because he's the one, he's Hillary number three, right? Mm -hmm. Lucky number three. Okay. So let's go with uh, Rough Rider. Mm -hmm. Rough Rider uh, will go ride with me. Which goes off. Mm -hmm. We go here. And we'll try to shoot Spawn Mother. Okay. Uh, even go here. Yes. This egg. Uh, no, it that doesn't get uh, give you cover, no, right? It's just destructible. Okay. So let's go here and shoot. Sounds good. Uh, your positive negates friendly fire. Yes. I have a 12. I will go to 18. Woo! I don't have anything to do about that. So 12 to 18, you're on a straight flip. Take, uh, take three, I think. All right. Uh, so that will kill her. And take three. Uh, her demise, the hatching, happens. Uh, I summon a Gups in yeah. this contact with every Eggy. So, um, one. Delete that, and... Blah. There we go. And it's mindless, so it's already activated, right? Correct. Does the Gups have... Uh, also stealth? They do. Really? Yeah. She 
all of the frogs have stealth because they're covered in mud. Hard to see him. Unfortunately, so I will second action. I will move. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Over to this. Yeah. Okay. Now your turn. Okay. How do we want to do this? I guess we can go with a Zerada here. Um, and I think what we'll have a Zerada do is or actually um Yeah, yeah, that's what we'll do. Zareda will go. Her first trick is she's going to use Hex on the Voodoo Doll, who will relent. And I am going to be cheating the four of Rams in for the My Loyal Servant trigger. Voodoo Doll will take two damage and injured one. So Sadir will take one damage and injured one. And if Voodoo Doll dies, did she still take injure? Yes, because the damage and injured happen as part of resolving the attack. Okay. And the will o wisp. Take one damage and injure. Yep, I will heal the will o wisp with uh, my little servant. And I will be cheating this in to heal it too. Voodoo doll is dead. Zareda is then going to discard both of our hands with her bonus. Okay. And then... Let's see. Do I have... A line of sight to these little gups. I do. Perfect. I will concentrate and then I will spend concentrate to hex McCabe and get around his concealment through the gups. Okay. I currently have a 15 against willpower. I will go to 18. 18? That will fail. Zareda will be done. At the end of her activation, she will discard a card and summon a voodoo doll and attach the upgrade back onto, or this time the upgrade is going onto uh, the botanist. Okay. Okay, so I will go with Mac Cape probably. 
Yes. He will die, so let's do something. Start with ride with me. Mm -hmm. I need a five. I get it. Apps has zero in engagement. That is correct. One, two, two, three, five. Then I will move. Oh, at, technically, One, they're puny. Even though they have a zero inch engagement, they don't count as engaging you. Oh, that's better. So one, two, three, four. Uh, so I can go through them. And there will be no engagement, right? As I understand. Uh, that is correct. McCabe has this ability that can go through models and then mm -hmm. they need to do bonus action then I will go one two three four five six seven so these gaps need to take the N13 move the well mm -hmm. or take two damage I need a nine to pass I don't I take two damage boop, boop. and I will charge will be Second action. Mm -hmm. one, uh, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, okay, I will not charge. I will move seven. So the second gaps need to take this duel. They also fail. They will also take two damage. Boop, boop. Then I will charge. Uh, just as One, just so you know, two. when you end a move in two inches of the Will O Wisp, you gain distracted after resolving the current action or ability. So if you end with. But, the current action will be this move or after the uh, attack? It is after the move because charge is technically a push equal to your move after which you can take an attack action which is a separate action. Okay, so the second move will be a little bit different. Mm -hmm. It will be uh, like this. Mm -hmm. So the gap still, still will take this well, and then I will charge like this, so mm -hmm. it will be one, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> and like this. Mm -hmm. So Zoraida and Voodoo Doll need to take this well. Uh, Voodoo Doll will pass. Zoraida will fail, so she will take two. And then I will try to hit Voodoo Doll. Okay. Doll or... No, I will try to hit Zoraida. Sorry. That's okay. That is a 7. I have 15. 7 to 15? Well, you know what? I am not going to do anything, but I am going to declare the Regret Trigger. So if you do damage to me, uh, we will immediately end the attacking model's activation. After result. Okay. That's his, sec uh, his last action, so it doesn't matter. This is true. <laughs> so it's straight flip, right? Mm -hmm. It's 15 to 7. That is correct. Right? So, right? Mm -hmm. So you will take three. Take three. And I will go uh, inches like this. 
do to the voodoo duel need, voodoo duel uh, need to take tn 13 move duel or take two damage mm -hmm. he will take two and botanist will take one okay and <laughs> then uh, willow wisp voodoo doll and zoraida need to take t 13 defense duel or take two damage mm -hmm. Uh, Lucas will gain distracted because he ended a move engaged within two of the Will O Wisp. Will O Wisp okay. uh, will fail the test and will take two damage. Voodoo Doll will pass the test. Zoraida um, will fail and will take two damage. And that's my cape done. That seems pretty reasonable for a master. I will have the Will-O-Wisp go. For it dies, it is going to use Distracting Illusion on the Voodoo Doll who relents. Okay. Hey, it goes off. I'll make that a crow trigger. Uh, so the doll gains stunned, distracted, and slow. And the botanist gains stunned, distracted, and slow. Distracted, right. Stunned. Right, slow. Bear. Hush. Okay. I will now try and do the same thing to McCabe. Against willpower? Yep, uh, this is a 14 against willpower. 18. That will fail. The will o wisp is done. Okay. Let's see. Let's go with. Let's go with Huckster number one. Mm -hmm. uh, copy him. It will be five. Then is it even one? No, so I will not be able to charge charge here. Probably. Okay, so let's go with move and move. Okay. And try to uh, do uh, his uh, bonus action. Mm -hmm. uh, willpower test uh, five against your willpower. I have an eight. I have a ten. Okay, I am not going to cheat. Okay, so let's discard the top card of our decks. I have a jack. You can take you can take this card and I will gain Soulstone. Okay. That's Huckster done. And we're within an inch of each other, is that correct? Mm, probably not, because if if we will in inch I will say that I will charge you. Okay, then I will butterfly jump to be within an inch. Okay. And still in base contact with the symbol marker. Okay. Alright, um, we're not going to go with them just yet. 
we're going to have the Will-O-Wisp go. This in the bottom right here. Okay. It is going to... Uh, actually, no. We'll go with the Voodoo Doll before you have a Sadir do things. The Voodoo Doll is going to attempt to Hex McCabe. I have distracted, so I'm on a negative here. Okay. Step four against your willpower. Got a ten. Yep. All right, that fails. Um. Oh, humbug! I forgot things. I got all the things actually. The voodoo doll is done because it was slow. Okay. And it was stunned, so I couldn't kill itself to draw a card like I was going to. Okay, so I will go with Huckster number two. Mm -hmm. I will try to disengage. I will try and keep you here. Okay. Uh, That's a 12. 12 to my six for now so i will cheat put you negative i'm at nine okay and because i am zareda and i can s i cannot see you never mind there's trees in the way yeah. all right yes. uh negative to my keepy here flip oh minus six to your flip anyway oh, really this will-o-wisp is just like stuck on you no 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 <laughs> i need only one inch mm. okay i will try to sail speech on you so i against your real power Pfft. well here are my severes 17. okay Okay, so let's try to disengage once more. Okay. Seven. I will go to nine. Uh, no. No nine. If you are seven, I will go to eight. Eight. Um. Cannot cheat because it was... Negative. That is correct. I guess you are I going to get away. Two, three, four, five. Mm-hmm. That's hacks. They're done. Okay. You have a Jesse and a Sadir left. Yes. Um. What do I want to do here? Sorry. Um, I guess I'll have my Gups number three go. They're going to go one, two, three, four. And they're going to try and leap. Uh, they don't get it. They require a three of masks. So there's a four of masks. They're going to go right here. And they're going to spend focus to try and punch McCabe. Okay. Because why not? Uh, stat four against your defense. Eighteen. Yep, that'll fail. That is the gups done. Okay. I have Willow Wisp, other Sillarid, and I think that's it. I will go with, will go with Jesse. One, two, three, four, five, ten. Let's see. 
this shock course. Okay, I will try flare, which will go off. What can I? I think you can hit the wisp and the doll. Okay, so let's take willpower 13 or take one damage. Okay, we'll do the wisp first. Uh, currently failing, I will cheat this for it to pass. Voodoo doll. Uh, if it's a 13, it's willpower 3, so it will fail, and that's fine. So it's what, one damage and distracted? One damage, yeah, one damage and distracted. Okay, so botanist will gain distracted and a damage. It's distracted. Okay, and then I will try to assist Sidir. Mm -hmm. Take all of his distracted. Sounds good. I have Will O Wisp and Sillerid. So, what we'll do is I'll have the Will O Wisp go. It's going to declare a charge and okay. go here. Because you have a one inch engage, you're going to stay out of your engagement. And my Will O Wisp is going to try and smack you with some distracting illusions. Stat four against your willpower. I'm at 13. I'm at 16. Okay, so I will gain. I will not cheat. Okay, stunned and distracted. Rise. Stunned and rise distracted. Okay. And we'll try it again. That is a 16 again. Oh, red That's joke. Miss. That's the wisp done. Okay, so let's go with Sidir now. Mm -hmm. mm. He's stunned and slow, so only one action. Mm -hmm. No triggers. No triggers. Oh no, and it's a little bit outside of Zoraida's, unfortunately, mm -hmm. of his machine gun. So let's try, oh, and Wheel of the Wisp is within one inch, uh, within uh, engagement, so it's friendly fire, so it's very good. Oh, let's try to hit this gaps. Okay. With his machine gun. Oh, the gaps are sitting pretty at a 14. Uh, also at 14. I think he got him. Quick reflexes. Mm -hmm. But I cannot I cannot declare triggers. Correct. Uh, it's within, I think, two of uh, my blown apart, so it doesn't have cover, so mm -hmm. it's single negative, uh, double negative. Correct. Take two. That's enough. Bloop, it's gone. Uh, so it's Sidir, and he's no longer slow and no longer slow stunned long so yeah um, I think all I have left is my Sillerid I think you're done as well yes okay so Sillerid uh, is going to spend focus to try and punch uh, your Huckster Huckster okay I'm at 10. Okay, 
I am at a 14. Showing infect. Okay, so it's uh, straight because of focus. That is correct. Um, uh, that'll be severe for four. And you gained a poison. It's four. And uh, I'll punch you again. Okay. That's an eight. That's a twelve. How's a sixteen sound? Sound like a hit. Okay. Negative twist. Negative. Uh, declaring onslaught on the case I black joker. But I don't. That is killed. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that will be four symbol for you. Yep. Uh, so that'll be the turn. Um, yes. So we both score the strategy, I believe. Yes. I don't score anything else on my schemes. Uh, you've revealed one scheme. Do you reveal your second scheme? No. Fortunately not. Okay. Well, let us go into turn five. This is a nail biter. You have almost wiped me off the board. I will discard the two of masks, the two of rams, and the black joker. I will discard four to two and two. Mm -hmm. Shuffle. I will soulstone. Okay. And for what it's four. worth, Sadir is no longer poisoned, but he is at two wounds. Yeah. He's no longer injured. Mm -hmm. We have still 24 minutes, so probably we'll finish our game. I think we will. I will discard this 3 and this 8. <laughs> Let's go for initiative. I have plus 2. Here we go. Off. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Also one, so... Mm -hmm. uh, um, I'm gonna go for a 13 here. Do you have a 13? Or I guess any severe to tie? Yep, you do. Yes, I okay. have 13. I have... Oh, I will start... 1, 2, 3, 4, oh, okay. 5, 6 models. You have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 Both models. Six. Okay. There's no pass tokens. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I will go with Lucas. Uh, I will try to hit Zoraida. Ah, okay. Uh, if she will die, she still can declare triggers. Yes, she can. So I will not hit her. I will go with ride with me. Mm -hmm. Uh, I need a, oh, I need a five, I think. I don't have five, I have nine. I will look at the I top will... card of your deck, because you cheated, and I will okay. get rid of it. We'll go one, two, three, four. Play a little bit. direction one two three four five so gaps need to uh, gaps need to take uh, in 13 move the wall or take two damage we will go ahead and that will fail the gaps die Bloop. okay and i will spend my soul stone To have positive to try to hit Zoraida with my net gun. Okay. Ah! 
Well, this is against my move, yeah? Against your move, yes. I am at 17. I will go to oh. 17. I do apologize. At the start of Zoraida's activation, or at the start of your activation, you were engaging Zoraida, so you did have to discard a card or gain stunned because of penetrating stench. So I figure okay. if you have a uh, throwaway card. Uh, okay, so I will discard this 10. Yeah. Okay, so you're, you're now at what is your total? 18? Uh, yes, I matched you. Um, well, I'm at 17. So you're one up uh, on me? Uh, you, you have 18. Have, oh, you have move 4. Yeah, they're move 4. So yes, I have, I have 18. So I you got me. have one more. So it's negative. Mm -hmm. Take two. All right. That's a dead Zoraida. And then uh, he's no longer distracted. But I want to... Uh, this was uh, almost one action. Second action will be move. And third action will be taking the symbol of authority. Makes sense. That's my cape done. Okay. Oh, well, I think what we'll do is... I will have Will-O-Wisp number two go. Okay. Oh, will I? Nah, not yet. Although it is not engaged, and you do have a Sadir who can go. Uh, so what we'll do is... Will-O-Wisp is going to go five inches to here. And then it's going to go five more inches and hang out right here. Okay, so I will go with Huckster. Who yes. will try to disengage. Right, I'll try and keep it here. Got a nine against willpower. It's 15 from my side. Uh, um, actually, uh, so you have nine. Okay, so, so that goes off. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, I think, something like this. Correct. And you have one more action because then you I'm... are stunned. Okay. And I will try to do fa false claim. Mm -hmm. Need a six. This is the six. Mm -hmm. So I will put two scheme markers in three inches of him. Mm -hmm. One, two. And at the end of my turn, I need to remove one of them. That is correct. Or you need to remove a scheme so marker that... from the board. It doesn't have yeah. to be one of those uh, two. Yeah. It's one one of my scheme markers from the board. So that's all from him. Okay. Um so what we're going to do is I'll have this Willow Wisp go. And it's going to just take a walk. Because let's see. The reveal is two more from the scheme markers than two inches. Not within three in line of sight of an enemy model. So I'll go here. And what I'm going to do is I will ambush with the Will-O-Wisp. Uh, I am not engaged, and I'm in 
concealing terrain, I don't have to discard a card. Let's see. So that's putting me one, two, three. So I will do it in such a way that I am within three of that marker. Um, problem. What's no that? problem. I'm sorry? No problem. Uh, two. Okay. Sorry, I have one more action. Yeah? Uh, it, you said there's no problem or there is a problem? There's no problem. Perfect. I am just going to drop a scheme marker. And I'll put it, like, here. Uh, I'll put it here so it's within two of these friends. Just in case you're going for sabotage, which I think you might be. I might. <laughs> who, who knows? Who will know? And okay. That, uh, that does have me within four of both those markers. Okay. Okay, I will go with Rough Rider, I think. Have only steel reads, right? That is correct. Okay, so I will go with Botanist. Mm -hmm. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, and do nothing more. Okay. That's the Botanist. I will have the Silurid up by the symbol of authority, Gal. Okay. He's going to interact to take the symbol down. Okay. And he's going to interact and drop a scheme marker on your side of the board. And he'll do a little dance. Uh, okay, but that's him done, right? That's him done, yep. Okay, so you will have the second point of breakthrough probably. I will go with Jess. Uh, no, I will not go with Jesse. Better option. Uh, I will go with Rough Rider. Mm -hmm. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, and then one, two, three, four, five, six. Then I will try to do. Uh, I will try to do right with me. I need a seven. Mm -hmm. It's not a seven, so I will go seven. I will go one, two, uh, one, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. This deal here. Seems good. That, that's rough right there. Okay. What I am going to do is have my Silurid go, because I have to, because I'm out of activations. And you guessed it, we're going to try and get that. Well, that's a thing. Jessie has a walk, and what is the range of her effect? Dig is six inches, needs a six. Your deck probably is going to flip you a six. So I might actually not be able to secure the breakthrough point, but I can make it very hard for you to kill my catch and release model. Catch and release at end game chosen in play on the enemy table half and not engaged. I can't be engaged. Yep. I think I'm going to have to settle for one point on breakthrough. Uh, Silurid is going to try and leap. And he is going to say, I am out of here. That's seven of masks. 
and he's going to go woo -woo 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 -woo, right over here. He has a move of five. So then he is going to run to here. Okay. And then he's going to go one, two, three, four, five. So probably I will not be able to do anything more. Let's see, there it's only walk four. Mm -hmm. You have unfortunately stealth. Without mm -hmm. this, I might be able to do something, but with this, no. Mm -hmm. So I think I will not do anything more. So that's the game. That is the game. Uh, so end of game. I will. I need to remove this one. Mm, yes. I will reveal breakthrough. Uh, I am within four inches and line of sight of the scheme marker. Is it the scheme marker or the model? Which it oh, it's, it's the model. And I have Lucas McCabe, who is. Yes, you do. Very nice. So that will get you that point. Um. And then and I point one once more here, and I get second. Let them bleed. Mm -hmm. But it's still not enough. It's one point for you. More. So a six seven game. Good game. Yeah, it's good game with this sick fast crew that you have. Silarid are uh, leap is a very powerful powerful ability and otherwise having move six is also really nice. I think you did a pretty yeah. good job yourself. Uh, those hucksters were getting around the board for you, and I really like your botanist with flush with cash. Actually, he mm, he didn't do much. He, he held he, an entire he flank. Like, he should be somewhere in the middle of the board where he can take soulstone from this flash with cash. Mm -hmm. The silurids are so sickly fast. Mm -hmm. You need only free, free and anything to leap. Mm -hmm. No, I am a big fan of running yeah. silurid heavy with Serrata. I know we were talking pre-game, which I don't know if you want to take a minute or two and talk about stuff, because I know it's late, your it's side no of the world. Yeah, it's, it's no problem. It's always good to, to talk a little bit and maybe <laughs> learn something more in you know, your game, so it's okay. Yeah, so coming into this pool, uh, when you saw Zareda, why did you select the schemes that you picked? And I guess, why did you pick the models you picked? Was it was it anything special about the Zareda, or was it more the pool? Um, what was like the big motivator? Actually, uh, let them bleed was pretty clear for me that with uh, McCabe with Cedir and maybe some others, I will be able to to score points on this. Mm -hmm. Uh, I did. Mm -hmm. which yes. was not... <laughs> you certainly did. Yeah, and then I tough made. I tough that two hucksters will go scoring, uh, and I did didn't do the do this. Uh, maybe I should should go with two hucksters and. That's why I, I go with Breakthrough, because of their ability to schemes mm -hmm. somewhere. Uh, I plan, the plan, of course, plan fails. The plan was to put some schemes on my side, remove after this uh, ability will go on. So uh, with two actions, from hucksters and maybe two from some other guys, I will be able to score full breakthrough. 
-hmm. This failed, unfortunately. So that was the plan, and I, I don't remember other schemes. Uh, but yeah, the, I think that uh, uh, oh, I might go with your mark, maybe. Maybe it should, it will be better than Breakthrough. Uh, but I can say this only after this game. Mm -hmm. I... That you, you, you don't have, uh, you, you didn't try to, to be at the center of the board, so... Mm -hmm. I... So maybe it will be better. I don't know. I, I think you are right on both your I, you both your picks made sense. I thought sabotage or breakthrough were both viable options. Because yeah, but I think that sabotage is uh, uh, really uh, easy to deny uh, one of the point one one of the points. But that's why I took the breakthrough. I thought that it would, it would be better, but mm -hmm. scored only one, so it wasn't better. Maybe maybe I should take sabotage on this building uh, on the right side of your deployment zone because it's within three of the deployment zone, so it might be easier to to take the sabotage on this. Could be, and if you if you take um, Jesse with you to help, because the thing for me was Jesse's a big deal with her ability to eat a scheme marker and turn it into a not scheme marker. Because a lot of, unless I go and throw a lot extra actions into dropping markers, I can't do leave your mark because Jesse will just negate it. And if I try and yeah. turn off your sabotage reveal, the minute I drop a marker, Jesse comes over, negates it, and guarantees you the reveal point unless I throw even more activations over there. And then I'm committing at least two models and two activations and like three or four AP uh, to that. So I think that's, this is a great pool for Jesse as far as why you brought her. I think that was a good yeah, pick. Yeah, that, that's why I brought her. Uh, the, the silly that goes uh, top left of my deployment zone, uh, mm -hmm. I thought that it would be easier to kill him before he took the second... Uh, second uh, symbol mm -hmm. and for unfortunately he, he was lucky to he was to still be alive so, uh, that, and that's the whole shockwave problem right like shockwaves are good but it, you can your opponent can just flip what they need to to not take damage yes but but there was also a uh, botanist but uh, mm -hmm. i didn't have uh, the cross on hand when when he hits this uh, the silly read because with with this he will get plus one damage and this also be enough because the silly read stays on one one health. Yeah, and butterfly jump wasn't doing you any favors either. Just scooting around. Yeah. Um, I mean, I think you definitely made me make poor choices with butterfly jumps so you definitely were leveraging your mobility and also like let's be real look where lucas mccabe ended the game remember he left your deployment zone got on my side of the board went back to your deployment zone yeah and then went all the way around the board and ended where he is um you 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 did a you got a lot of use out of him and i think that really made me sweat um, because while I may have had my incidental pushes and stealth and stuff, you were able to really get where Jesse's simple duels weren't doing a lot because it was like a one and done. Hitting two or three models with Lucas really put a pressure on my hand when I didn't need that pressure. Um, and that's what ultimately got you to, you know, you got Zareda down which is kind of hard sometimes. Um, so, that was good. Um, yeah, and I, I, the one thing I, that I didn't figure out before the game was 
uh, this wheel of the wisp that can uh, attack uh, voodoo doll mm-hmm. which really uh, make my plans failed will o are really, really good yeah and uh, admittedly I should have on the turn before you sent the botanist down on the left side, I should have run my Will-O-Wisp behind the symbol marker because symbols aren't blocking terrain, right? So I can like hide behind it and put that two inch engagement range out. So yeah. you, you can't interact with it. And trying to get to the wisp is going to be hard because the symbols are impassable, I think. What are they? Yes, yes yeah. they are con- concealing that the impossible. Yeah, so I completely forgot about that. I was trying to get cute with luring Zareda, but I should have just gone behind it. And then you couldn't come in and take it turn two with um, your botanist. And yes. And then I don't know if that would have changed what you did with your botanist or how you approached, but... Um, yeah, the, the Will-O-Wisp for four stones, they are an absolute fantastic addition uh, to a Zerada crew. Um, the synergy with Voodoo Doll is, ob- is, you know, not apparent at first, but, I mean, we saw it basically turns off your model for a turn. Yes, giving too distracted. Actually, this will be... Uh distracted and you will not get the slow condition also mm-hmm. if, uh, for example the seed you get the slow mm-hmm. and if you will not uh, not uh, give him slow it will be better because he can still uh, walk and gain focus from walk and then then shoot but mm-hmm. with slow of course he did, did didn't i I was uh, afraid of uh, Zoraida's uh, old base, mm-hmm. and this may maybe this was the mistake that uh, uh, the first turn when when I go with uh, a cape, I did right with me, but didn't bring Cedar with me. Uh, mm, that's right. And maybe maybe I should take him and place him closer, so maybe it will be better. I don't know. Uh, maybe. It, maybe this was a mistake. I was afraid that you will mm-hmm. obey him and do some not very good things to my crew. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. May, maybe, maybe it might be better. I, I don't know. Well, all the same, uh, it was an absolute pleasure. I uh, hope you had fun. I know I did. Um, we're coming up on the end here of time. Uh, did you want to give any shout-outs or anything? Uh, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> nope. You don't have to if you don't have any, I, anything to hand. I need to rethink, rethink this mm-hmm. game. Maybe, maybe I will... If you put this on YouTube, maybe I will try to watch this again and, and see what can what what can I do better. Oh, it will be up there. I'll send you I'll send you a link once it's up. So, all right. Well, thank you again, and thanks, folks, for watching.